Tomorrow, Spencerville's Kaylee Davis will take the court at the state tennis tournament in Mason. It's the culmination of a lot of hard work for Kaylee, who achieved her goal despite injuries and the lack of a tennis program at Spencerville. So on the eve of the biggest match of her career, Kaylee is the subject of this week's OIO Prep Profile. Last season, Kaylee returned from a fractured wrist and it looked like she was on her way to the state tournament until she suffered another injury at districts. In my second round, I rolled my ankle, so I was pretty devastated knowing that I've been close now for the past two years, losing the round before state. So she used that as motivation for her senior season. And after winning her first two district matches, Davis fulfilled that dream of qualifying for state. I didn't have any nerves on Saturday, so I had no pressure. The pressure's been off now, and so for Friday at State for me, it's just about having fun. Kaylee's accomplishments are even more impressive when you consider that Spencerville doesn't have a tennis program. Jeff Davis, Kaylee's dad, volunteered to coach her, and she does not play a regular season dual match schedule, only competing in invitational tournaments and the postseason. It's taught me a lot of leadership. I mean, just with my dad and I, because I don't have anyone else to rely on. And so I'm out there and my dad is with me, but a lot of it I have to do on my own. I have to think out there by myself. And so I've learned a lot of life skills through it. She has uh, not fired me this year. So it has been a very good uh, year this year. So it, it's, a, it's challenging to know how much to push and how much not to push. Because as a father, you know that you can get a little bit more out of her. Davis is a role model both on and off the court. She's a terrific student, class president, student council secretary, and leader of Spencerville's Fellowship of Christian Athletes. FCA has been probably the most important extracurricular to me just because I was, I'm able to share my faith with, with, um, with a bunch of kids at our school. I mean, we have about 20 to 30 kids in our program, and so it's been awesome to show that to talk to them about what helps me to get through just sports but also life as well and to make good decisions it's been really a blessing. Kaylee has a good head on her shoulders she makes very good decisions and she has a lot of convictions that she is uh, it's a lot of black and white whether things are right things are wrong she'll grow up to be a, a fine young woman. After high school Kaylee hopes to continue her tennis career in college before that, though, there's a big match tomorrow as she hopes to make one more lasting memory as a Bearcat. I've had a lot of memories made at sectionals and districts and a lot with my dad, too. My dad and I have really bonded through this and also a lot with the teachers and staff at my school. They've been so supportive, especially our athletic director, John Zerby, and our principal, Scott Gephardt. They have been just so helpful and so supportive through everything, and all the teachers have been as well. So it's just been a great experience all around. In Spencerville, I'm Matt Finkel for the Sports Report.